Hello, Brian Fazio, Newton County's Public Information Officer, here with you for another Newton update. I'm here today in front of the Newton County Board of Elections and Registration Office here in the Administration Building. Today is Wednesday, August 23rd, which is National Poll Worker Recruitment Day. Please join me today as we sit and talk with our Director of Board of Elections and Registration, Angela White Davis, to talk to you about what a poll worker does and how you can become involved. Hi, I'm here today with Angela White Davis, our Director of the Board of Elections and Registration here in Newton County. Good morning. Good morning, Brian Fazio. Thank you for coming to visit me on today, which is the National Poll Workers Recruitment Day. So I'm here to invite each of you that are interested in coming to be a poll worker for Newton County to assist us in the upcoming elections. The next election that we have on the calendar right now is November the 7th, and it will be a City of Covington election and also a countywide election. So we are indeed looking for poll workers to work. And as a poll worker, you would be the greeter to our democracy. The role you play on election day is vital to the confidence voters have in our system. Yes. Um and it's a crucial it's a crucial part of our whole election system. I know every every year when I go to my poll I see happy smiley faces or happy to be there. What are some of the people, what are some of the qualifications people have to have in order to be a poll worker here? Qualifications to be a poll worker. You have to be at least sixteen and a half years of age, a US citizen, and uh, excellent customer service skills, but you also have to be able to stand for a long period of time. And we do ask that poll workers arrive at their designated precincts by 5.30 a.m. because we have to set up for the election for that day. Okay, I'm sold. How do I apply? Great. <laughs> <laughs> to apply, there is a paper application that you can actually stop by our office, and we are located at 1113 Usher Street, Suite 103. We're in the administration building on the first floor. Also, you can go out to the Newton County Board of Commissioners website and go to the Board of Elections and Registrations Department site, and there is an online application. I am asking all applications to be in by the deadline of September the 1st, because we do have an election in November, and training will start in the month of September. Okay, and I've, I've applied, I'm ready to come work. How do I know which uh, precinct I'll be in? Is a precinct just in my local municipality? Is it countywide? Great I'll question, like great question. Um, when assigning poll workers, we really try to get them to the one that is closest to their home, which is usually sometimes the one that they vote at. But in some cases, some precincts that may be located in a different area of Newton County may be in need of poll workers. So the assignments will be made accordingly. Even though you have applied for, uh, even though you've completed an application, for a poll worker, you may not necessarily be assigned for the November 2023 election, but we are preparing for the 2024 election also. All right. So I'm going to help with democracy if I apply. I may be close to my house, so I'm going to see a bunch of neighbors. So this, oh, well, I appreciate it. Anything else you'd like to add uh, about this? No, at this point, um, I am inviting you all once again to complete an application to become a poll worker. Um, we appreciate all the support that the county has provided to us. We are also currently working with the Georgia State University. They are their political science class. A couple of those students have already applied. So we are excited about the team that we're building for this 2023 and 2024 election season. And this really is a crucial part of our election season, which as everybody knows, is a crucial part to our everyday uh, lives as we've seen elections do affect and we need to run them smoothly uh, and we have great people who do that and it's all in part to people like Angela but also people in her staff and people who uh, apply for these positions and we thank you for doing that and thank you we thank you for doing everything you do I appreciate the support just know the only way your opinion counts is if you vote <laughs>